Hello boys and girls and parents. Welcome to Toddler Time. I'm Miss Kay here at the Hewitt Public Library and today we're going to read a book about shapes and we have all these different books in the library about shapes. Are you ready to sing hello friends? Let's go. Ready? Don't let Miss Kay forget that. Here we go. Hello friends. Hello friends. Hello friends. It's time to say hello. Alrighty. Now, why are shapes important for boys and girls to learn? Well, even when you're starting out with babies, it's great to show them shapes and to have them do the little, the little shape, um, you know, the little uh, toys that have the shapes where they put the different shapes into the bucket. And that, that's great. It's a foundation for early literacy because it's the first step in learning to identify letters when they get older. So when they look at different shapes, they see the lines and the circles and the curve, the lines and the curves. And so then when they see the letter A, they can relate to well, like a triangle, letter C or O with the curve, and then these and these, all those. So shapes uh, are very important to the foundation of early literacy. So we're gonna start with that book. Our book today is Skippy John Jones. I love Skippy John, I hate to skip it. So this one is Skippy John Jones, Shape Up. And Judy Shackner is the author and illustrator. And I encourage you to read all of Skippy John's books. They are so cute and funny. He's something else. Okay, you ready? All right. Skippy John Jones stays in shape by running in a circle. Then he sauces on a square. He teeters on a triangle. He orbits an oval. It's so around and around an oval. He reaches for the stars. He rocks the crescent, tugs at your heart, pumps two rectangles, bounces a diamond on his nose, also called a rhombus, and stops at the octagon. Then Skippy John follows the arrows to his mirror to check out his new muscles. That's Skippy John. He's so funny. That's it for Skippy John. Work on your shapes this week, boys and girls. Well, it's time for me to go. So let's say goodbye. Come by and see me in the library though. Are you ready? Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. See you next time on Toddler Time.